Hi everyone, I'm Val, if you may or may not know, and on this video, we're gonna be talking about my mannequin head, Bernard. Say hi, Bernard. Just kidding, Bernard can't talk, he's a mannequin head. The story of Bernard is that he was my high school theater's mannequin head, which is usually the mannequin head that wears all like the costume wigs and everything. If you wanna style a wig, you just put it on Bernard and you know, style the wig. But the thing with Bernard was that he was like at least the first time I can remember seeing him, he had this face on him, all right? And you know, beautiful as ever. But I was like, okay, well, he has a face, now he needs a name. The first thing I thought was, his name is Bernard. I don't know how I thought Bernard. I thought, I think I just like looked at him and I was like, okay, well, that's Bernard. And you know, to officially call him Bernard, it says it on, you know, on his stand or whatever. This is another story, I'll get to it later. I had to take Bernard home to style a wig that I was gonna use for a skit. This was a long time ago. Nine to 10 months ago, I would say, is when I brought Bernard home to style that wig. Now, I kept forgetting to bring Bernard back to school, mainly because no one asked for Bernard back. But October of this year, I kinda was like getting ready for school and I remembered, you're supposed to be at high school. And you know what Bernard said? Nothing, because he's still a mannequin head. But it doesn't matter because I brought him back to my high school and I told my theater teacher, I was like, sorry, this is yours. And I kind of left him at my house for, you know, seven, eight, 10 months, a lifetime even. I don't, I don't remember. And so my theater teacher was like, all right. Now, a little bit later during the rehearsal, she was making props for our performance. And one of the props was something that could get a braid over a wall, like a braid of hair. And she looked at Bernard and she was like, you know what? If we just stick Bernard onto a pole, we can kind of put the braid on and then just put only the braid over the wall. And I was like, okay. And so without hesitation, she takes Bernard and just impales Bernard with a pole. Let me just say something is that I am not like trying to villainize my theater teacher. My theater teacher is one of the nicest people in the entire world. And so don't think of her in a bad light. I'm just being very overdramatic. Bernard was impaled onto the pole. And what happened was Bernard broke in half, all right, which talks about this, you know? But what happened was he was gonna be used for the prop and then she figured out an easier way. And so Bernard was just, you know, Lay. I just draw Bernard. Um, hold on. If you like look, there's like so many like dents and like cuts into his head just cause he keeps like falling over. You know, he got impaled. He was just like laying there and my theater teacher was like, oh, sorry Val. And I'm like, that's okay. And I'm just over here, you know, in tears. That's a lie, that's obviously a lie. What happened was she found an easier way to do the prop. And so Bernard was just like kind of still stuck on the pole. And I was just like, okay, well, uh, theater teacher, can I take Bernard back with me? And then she was like, yeah, it's, a, it's okay, I'm sorry. And I was like, it's okay, I can just duct tape him back together. And two months later, I still haven't duct taped him back together because I keep forgetting. So Bernard is now at my house and you know, I'm just like kind of looking at him and like, well, I don't know what to do with you now. But then a, like a month later when we we're done with the performance, I realized what Bernard could be used for. Bernard could wear the wig that I wore during the production, which here I'll show you. It's called the Tracy wig because it looks like a Tracy Turnblad from Hairspray, you know? And so Bernard now wears the Tracy wig. See, there you go. Bernard is as beautiful as ever wearing the Tracy Turnblad. No, it's just called the Tracy wig, you know? The Tracy wig. Tracy. Anyway, oh, okay, this is kinda. So if you see Bernard in any future videos, I think it was in my my uh, first official video too, the hi video. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed Bernard's story as much as I enjoyed making this video. I hope you all subscribe. I hope you all like this video. Bye.